Ah, uh, here we go. Welcome back, everyone, to another T Bros Entertainment video. Today, I'm going to show you how to design a legit kitchen for your house or other area, any other building that uh, you live in on Animal Crossing. So, before we begin, don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and turn the notification bell so you don't miss any more Animal Crossing videos. And I'm going to use Harvey Studio as like an example, you know, almost like a portrait. So, let's get on in there. Ah, here we go. Okay, first of all, before you start placing down any furniture, you need the proper flooring and wall. So, if we go to the floors here, stone or honeycomb tile, like a, like a simple white flooring like this white honeycomb tile, you know, or I prefer stone tile. And then if you move on to a wall here, we'll just do like a simple white wall just like that, you know. Just so you can clear things out. Okay. <clears throat> now the next thing you want to do is start placing out different confinements as well. So now, first thing I'm going to do is set down an apple rug. You don't have to do an apple rug, but you can place down any kind of food-themed object, you know, in your kitchen. So, kind of perfectly, like, lay this up in the middle here. I think that'll do. Um, now, the necessary materials. So, what you're going to want to do first is you need... An oven of some sort. Or, you know, something that you typically find, you know, in a kitchen. So, let's just say, perfect, a dishwasher. You're going to want a dishwasher, so why don't we place that right over there, you know, just do that. And then, and then the simple kitchen. You can change it up if you want to. You don't have to, but I'm going to do beige. Oh crap, I didn't want to do that. And then, uh, let's put it, uh, let's put it right here. You can see it covers, like, the, like, the hole in the wall a little, you know? Okay, uh, you're gonna want, like, several kitchen counters, because that's completely necessary. So, you can just, like... You know, put stuff like right here or something. Ooh, I don't want. Yeah, I'm gonna need something bigger to like cover that up. Okay, uh, let's add a couple more just to make sure. And then uh, well, let's put them right over here. You know, just for the record. And uh, let's put another one. Maybe like right here would be good. Okay, now before you get any, uh, what's the word? Miscellaneous, I'm pretty sure that's the word. We gotta place down more stuff, so. A brick oven, you know. You definitely need one of those things. Let's go with white on that one. You can put it in a simple, oh crap. You can put it in a simple place, like, I think we, I think I can, like, cover up this wall just a little. No. Let's go right over here. Yeah, yeah. Done that. And then a sink of some sort, you know. A sloppy sink. Let's, let's put that right there, you know. And you're going to want another sink, of course. So how about an ironwood sink? Let's, let's go with oak. And you can just... Okay, and you probably should place it next to one of the counters, like, uh... You know, like, like right here, you know, nice and simple. Okay, and, uh, another thing you should definitely need is a fridge. Well, mine's yellow, it can be whatever. And you can just, uh, any kind of sticker on it, or even a custom, because, you know, I'm just going to put down Cubo and I'll see, of course. I'm going to put the fridge... Let's put it right here. Yeah. Okay, so. <clears throat> 
uh, I don't think, I think we, we might be good with, like, the basic housewares and stuff. Okay, now you need cooking tools, like, we can get a knife block, and we can put that on one of these counters right here. Yeah, we can put a knife block right there, and, uh, a scale. And you can do whatever color if you have, like, I'm gonna do green here, so, I think I'm gonna just put that right over here, rotate it a little bit. Uh, a mixer. I'm gonna do a red mixer, you know, add a little color or something. Uh, let me put that, uh, right there, okay. Got that. Let's do a carp on a cutting board. Oh, I like the red. It looks like a red snapper. We can put that right over here to the knife block, you know. Just to make it, you know, pristine a little. Okay, um. We definitely... Okay, we need a deep fryer. You just gotta have a deep fryer. And you, you can just... Let's put it right there, nice and simple. Okay. Ooh, espresso maker? I think you might need that. You need some silverware, of course, like a like a rack or just silverware. You can put it on a sink, you know, just for something like that. A spice rack. Uh, I'll have to think about that. Well, you know what? Yeah, let's put a spice rack. Just put it next to the mixer right there. You know what? Let's turn that around a little bit. Yeah, yeah. Just turn it around like this. All right. Now you need. <clears throat> okay, yeah, I think that's. Oh, we need. We need some more stuff on the on this these counter fray here. Let's put. Um, let's put a soup kettle right here next to the. Wait, actually, no, not the soup kettle. Let's put. Let's put a toaster. Let's put a toaster right here. And now, this counter over here. Let's place down a mixer. Let's do oranges. Put a mixer right there. And let's put... Let's go with... Let's go with a coffee grinder. Wait, no, not next to a shaker, no. Wait, wait, I, I got something, so... I'll put these two mixers right next to each other. And then, for the spices, um... Let's put a soup kettle right here, because, you know, the spices and the soup, you know? Just to, like, spice it up a little bit. The oh, gosh, what happened to the toaster? I literally placed it right... Oh, that was weird. Okay, um, I'm not sure if I'll, I think we could put down just, like, a couple more little things right here. Okay, a garbage can. You'll definitely need a garbage can. Let's, uh, let's put that right here next to the brick oven. And now, something to cover up this big hole right here, um... You don't have to do this, but, uh, you can put down, like, a vending machine or something. You know what? Let me do this. Let's just put down the snack machine, you know? Just get that over with. Wait, can I change the color? Oh, I like the black a little better. Boom, now it just, like, kind of covers it up. Okay, um... Now, if you want, you can place down, like, a table and chairs, which I'm gonna do, because, you know, you know, it's a kitchen, you know, sometimes you have a table and chairs, so you need, like, a, like, a big table, uh, let's just do, like, a simple wooden table, you know, it could be any color you want, necessarily, uh, I'm gonna choose dark wood, the, let's go with, Let's go with pink. You know, you could have a nice, simple table like that. 
You can even place down some, like, food as well, you know. Like, if you go over here, you know, you can place down, like, a fruit basket, you know. Maybe some clam chowder, pumpkin pie, maybe some bread. And then you can, like, sort it however you want, you know, so you can just get that simple and over with. Okay. And, uh, we can add some more stuff on, like, on top of things as well. So, on top of the vending machine, let's put down some silverware. Wait, hang on. I, I'm i going to change the toaster. Uh, I'm going to place on some cans. Can, can snacks. Can snacks. Okay, so on top of the vending machine, silverware and some coffee beans. Uh, oh, gosh. Why are they over there? Put the coffee beans right there. Now, on top of the fridge... If I go over here, I can find some, like, flour and some sugar. You know, inside the bags and all that. Ah, oh, here we go. Flour. And, uh, I don't think I can do anything else at the moment. Wait, instead of coffee beans, uh, you know what? Let's just put, like, flour and sugar, you know, on top of the vending machine so that, you know... It's, like, simple enough. And then, uh... Okay, so... <clears throat> now, let's go with the walls now. Stuff for the walls. So, first of all, you're gonna need a shelf of some sort. Like, uh... Let's put the shelf over here, actually. Like, uh... Like, if I put the shelf right here, yeah, I can just, like, move it so that, you know, it's like an, it's like an easy grab. And then, maybe over here with, like, the spice rack, you could put, like, like a bottle shelf, you know, of, like, different, like, spices and stuff. And then, over here, we got, we got a knife rack, you know, for, like, cutting up things. And, uh, you definitely need a clock of some sort. Let's put the clock, like, up here, you know. And it's food themed, so you gotta do food themed as well. Just place it, like, place it like, right here in the center, yeah. And with, and you can put, like, down some, like, pots and pans as well. You can do, like, over here almost, yeah. Just, like, right there. Kind of like make it to like where you can see it, yeah. And uh, you need anything else? Yeah, no, I don't think so. And if you want for the ceiling, you can add like a lamp of some sort. Hang on, let me go to the ceiling. That's a pretty nice view from up here. So you can get like a lamp, maybe like above, like the, uh, like the thing, yeah. Simple enough like that. Boom. And then if you want, you can add a little more stuff, you know. But. Since, uh, oh, let me put that away. Okay, um, yeah, I think this will do. And so, once you're finished, you will have a legit kitchen area. Well, everyone, that will be it for today's video. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel, turn the notification bell so you don't miss any more videos just like this. And I'll see you next time in another Animal Crossing video.